Yo, what's up everyone? It's me, Matt from Diazabal, and we're here doing another album review. Actually, I guess this is an EP. Or no, <clears throat> a demo review to be honest. But yeah, we're checking out the band Eyes of Salt with their demo from 2023. A little bit of background on this band is they are a hardcore band out from Denver, Colorado. They have really, really uh, tight riffs, very emotional lyrics, and a very, very like in your face, let's fucking go kind of attitude. And I discovered this band because their record label, Our Pride uh, record label, I'll put the link down in the description, uh, hit me up and everything and said, hey, have you checked out Eyes of Salt? And I was like, nah, I have not, but I shall. And I did, and I'm super happy I did. Now let's do a little walkthrough with this demo from uh, Eyes of Salt. Father of my father, crunchy guitar intro and those lyrics from the get go. Oh my God, super emotional, super just cutting through. Like if you got some family issues in, you, in your life, this song will speak to you, I think. And the like with the emotions coming from the uh, the lyrics and with the guitar wrist, they just mm, meld very well together. The drums are very groovy and just like add a lot of flavor to the song. The vocals, super sharp. And then there's like the guitars in the back, like later in the song, they have like some like wailing, like guitar background noise. And it sounds pretty sick. And just overall, the lyrics, super charged, super emotional and freaking amazing. So I want to play a clip of Father of My Father. Bond. This song though has a little bit more of a southern style rock to it a bit. Kind of like it reminds me of Every Time I Die. The bass is kind of low in the mix, but it adds a lot of grooviness to the song. And then like midway through the song, about like 30 seconds in, they got this like sick like like thrash metal crossover style guitars that reminded me of like Power Trip or like Metallica. Very clean riffing on this song. And then uh, as the song goes along, it moves into like a, a fast upbeat swing and everything. And once again, the lyrics, super good, super deep. And the vocalist is just sharp and just on it. Ooh, don't shed your tears. Again, more emotionally charged lyrics with even more heart filled uh, vocals, solid ass rips here, clear percussions. And then like the chorus is very heavy and uh, has a good groove to it. And then uh, there's a smooth transition into the bass solo that gives a nice break with the song. And then uh, the drums are kind of backing it up and everything. Um, the riffs on this song in particular are just amazing and everything, like Chef's Kiss. So here's a little clip of Don't Shed Your Tears. Right into that bass, so clean. Grave slash memory. Uh, off the get go, I got some like it sounded like uh, some weird production here on the guitar. They sounded really muffled. The vocals still sound pretty clear, but the overall production on the song, the backing vocals sound a bit weird, kind of out of place. Drums are really hard to hear. Guitar is like turned up really high. The production is really wonky and weird on the song. Into nothing. Again, the production, very, very weird. I don't know what's going on here um, at the time of uh, listening to this, but I found out um, possibly there might have been some issues with the translation of the files and everything because the production is really stark contrast. And also I found out the last two songs on this demo were from previous uh, previous demo. So it made me understand why they were uh, a bit different, uh, the, the first three songs in these last two. The guitars are chugging really nicely on this song, but just really hard to mix, uh, hard to hear. Bass is lost in the mix. I don't hear it at all. Um, this song does remind me of Incinerary a bit with the vocals. 
has a bit of a more melodic style to it, which is kind of cool. And uh, especially on the chorus, has some uh, like more soft uh, sounding uh, vibes to it, I guess. And the breakdown is cool and all, but it's really hard to really feel anything on this track because the production is so weird. Yeah, that's my short review of this demo from Eyes of Salt. Uh, and like I said earlier, um, there's, I guess it's two demos put together and not realizing the first three songs are like their newer songs they've made and they sound great. C production sounds good. Vocals, Chris, uh, lyrics, awesome. Guitars, crunchy, bass, nice and uh, deep. Drums, firing at all cylinders. It's literally like perfect songs, These those three first songs. And then you get the other two songs, which apparently were on their older demos. And maybe that something got lost in the translation or wrong files because the production is very, very different. It's hard to hear everything. Everything is just really muffled and everything. So I feel like it kind of like skewed my view and thoughts of this uh, EP and everything. So I don't know if I got if I hear the proper files, I might be able to give a different opinion. But at the moment, um, it's night and day. The first three songs are very good song structure everything um production is amazing so the last two songs uh they're still pretty good songs i think but isn't the pr production is just such jarring and noticeable that it distracts me and like takes away from the songs a bit so with that being said uh this uh demo from eyes of salt is a good solid 8.5 out of 10. yeah so uh, if you're in the Denver, Colorado area, support your local scene. I'm pretty sure everyone loves Eyes of Salt. If you're not from uh, Denver, check out Eyes of Salt. They're pretty good, pretty slick. And also check out Our Pride record label. Uh, they put out some pretty good uh, bands and everything like uh, Time Heist and uh, Without Love, some other bands I've reviewed before. So check them out and everything. And thanks for coming on by, guys. My name is Matt, uh, Matt Diazable. Uh, check me out on my Instagrams and all my other stuff and i think i'm right a video is popping up right here so check it out and uh, like i always say like and subscribe i appreciate it bye yeah that's my short review of this demo from eyes